Here are the top 10 support position 4 tier list. This tier list are based on the current V7.28 C patch meta. There are several factors when it comes to ranking them. These heroes must have great mobility, ganking ability, and early to mid game advantage. We have Clockwork on the D tier. His battery assault ability allows him to harass and zone out enemies support position 5. His hookshot also great in initiating war early game. However Clockwork doesn't do well in mid to late game due to his low power spike. Next we got Lion and Rubik in tier C. These two heroes are great position 4 to trade skills and right clicking when it comes to playing along the offlaner. Finger of Death is a huge skill to nuke enemy and to secure a kill. Rubik's Fade Bolt is good to secure the range creep and spell steal ability is one of the best in the game. With just a blink dagger, these two heroes create a great impact in the game. In tier B we have Enchantress, Marana, and Trent Protector. These three heroes are on tier B for a similar reason. They are very disruptive and annoying heroes to play against if you are playing a position 1 carry on the enemy team. Enchantress and Marana both possess ability to farm neutral and harass the lane at the same time. Trent Protector with his ability to hide in trees and slowing enemy down with his nature's grasp skill. He forced the enemy to play with extra care thus, trading off their CS. Next in tier A, we got Bounty Hunter and Tuscar. These two heroes are the best heroes when it comes to ganking lanes. High mobility and high nuke damage are the best combo you can have as position 4 heroes. Bounty's track and Tusk's snowball are great skills when it comes to initiation and control. The top two heroes on the tier list are Nyx Assassin and Earth Spirit. Almost 80% of the competitive tournament game, these two heroes will get banned or picked. Reason due to their ability to move between lanes and create a play for their cores are beneficial and impactful. Nyx and S both don't require expensive item build, their abilities to create opening and initiating war as well as their escaping ability are excellent. Therefore I put them in the S tier.